Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Game Guy. No, and we're back to the next part of Let's Play Wolfcraft well, Season 2 here. Um, this one. Um, I'm gonna. I don't really have. Like, usually I kind of don't really have an idea of what I want to do. But I have an idea. A uh, plan this time, but not like. I think a blue plan. Uh, I figured that since we're on the new server, and because I came up with something for the casino here, and something for the nether, that, um,. That's what we're going to focus on in this video. So, first off, for the casino here, these parking games, I came up with a better uh, idea yet. My old one was this, where you click the one, fill up the two slots here and here, player one, two. Um, and I forgot why this chest was here, but I, I realized that this idea kind of sucks. And so I'm rebuilding it. I came up with another new idea like a few days ago. So, this is it. You know, player one here. Um, I think I'll put a sign here, playing a Player ones, player ones. That's here. Player ones, there, something. And basically, one play, one player stands here. Obviously, you don't build in. So yeah, like realistically, uh, this you know realistically this the table, poker table and stuff. And so, I think I'm gonna redesign it though. But for now, this, this is a template. Basically, to start the game, you hit the button, and you're Basically, goes to like poker to whoever has the mo the more cards. Meaning, you know, player one has twelve cards, while player only, while player whatever has X amount of cards, six cards. Player one obviously wins then. Um, idea basically. And so, the way it's gonna work, you click the button to activate the fencers. It's gonna shoot a, a random number of three cards in each test, completely randomized. And so, uh, in both. Both player ones and player two chest on their feet. They click it out. They open the chest. They see the cards they have just there, and then have um, item frames up here. They can basically place their item frames to show the other the other player what their cards are. Kind of like in real poker. Um, the idea was is that I was like thinking about it one day. Kind of came to me where it's like I poker game kind of sucks and it's kind of basic. And I actually want to have like more of a interactive version of it instead of just one box. So this is what I came up with. The other idea I had, I came up with the other day, which, which flash just now kind of a thing, is to actually have, I can't do it, have an actual card that, uh, showcase, um, somehow, I don't think you can do that, like, a certain number, piece of paper, like, say, like, 12, would, would, like, pop up on, like, display, like, here, obviously, like, here, more like, and so both players would see it and be like, okay, that's the card number we to get to, um, now, I would love, which I uh, talked to Sam about this, and he's gonna we're gonna look at the plugins for that, a more advanced version of it to where it actually can, sh I, where I, there's actually three D cards, stuff, actual like what I mean by three D cards, I mean just maps that look like that are like that look like cards, so, um, so I think that'd be kind of cool. Um, but for now, we're just gonna go with this. So I'm gonna build that off camera, and I'll be right back in a sec when it's finished. Here's the back, and I did it here. Let's see. Fun. I also I think my audio for this. Button. Oh, I need to. Proper auto dispenser. Hey, you think the dropper would drop the items? No, it dispens. I don't understand. It's pretty simple red zone. Oh, but one items. Basic premise is one on top, which activates this sensor, which item here. This activates this. Right there. Click the thing. One, two, three. 
basically it leaves sixth one and it pushes the item into the I don't know how we're here, which leaves it in there long enough to activate three. One, three. So um, I'm going to build the next one off camera here. Um, so that is it for the build part of this. Uh, for the rest of that, is actually, now I'll try and see if I can maybe a little nicer. So I'm going to go off camera here again. Try to see if I can. Off camera. It, sh it should always be. Okay. Uh, but, anyways, I'm going to build the table part of this and I'll be right back in a sec. Um, I, I probably will try looking also show showcasing uh, a, car a number of some sort inside here. Um, that or I may just, I don't know, I'll, I'll, cause I kind of want to add that, uh, but that probably will be another later on project. For now, I'm just going to work on this table, make it look fancy, and so I uh, will come back to you guys in a sec. Hey right, guys, I'm, I'm back again here. Uh, my, the idea here was to actually put wool on top of this, but then I had to this. Then I had a realization, I was like, no, wait, I can't do that, don't worry about it. This, this is to me what a poker table kind of looks like, it has like brown, dark brown stuff and light brown stuff, right? Had a realization that I could that cause item frames are actually how you're gonna showcase the cards off. We're gonna set up here. We're gonna show up there like that and both players. Showcase show you player. So like my idea is in real life poker, you have your cards and elves. Obviously, I could have made this dropper just, which is, or just off them on account. You pick them up like this, and then you can that put a chest here just so that way they don't appear. Either way, it's fine. And then so like you're basically viewing yourself, and everything, then place them on your table, which is what you actual poker. Uh, here, here, and here, three cards. Yeah, I think it's like actually one and three, but we're just going to with three. Um, to show both players what cards they have. So, like, I can see his cards, player two, player two cards, and my cards. So, that's also why I wanted to do the actual poker map. Uh, have a, a poker via map thing, to, so because when you place the map down, it fully fills out the full thing and looks like an actual like full on like item thing. So that would be cool if there, there's actual like cards here. And so yeah, anyways, this basically is the poker table. Uh, this is the the final version of it. Um, I am, uh, of this, I may add it to where both players have to get to a certain card number here. Um, where it gets the higher number basically wins. Um, now I don't know, I'm still trying to figure out the ruling for my poker game here, but I think I'm going to have it, have a, have a basic rules here. So three sides, player one, uh, stays in, player two stays in, and then rules here, basically. Base, that type of thing. Um, I don't know if I'm going to have, have a rule where you can redraw. I think whatever cards you get is what, what you get. Um, but that is the plan. Anyways, guys, I'm going to pause here again. I was about to say bye, but then I realized, oh, wait, no. Uh, and the next thing we're actually going to be working on here is the nether. Uh, I figured, I had a realization that the nether, we actually never actually built an actual pathway in it. We did on the newer server. Um, well, we never did it on this one. So I figured that will be the next big kind of project for me. Um, build it, uh, and stuff. So, uh, if you remember in the lesser, I actually built like path, actual like walkways and stuff. We've never actually done that in this one, and we have so much more farms in this one, and another in this one versus the other, versus the old one. So, uh, uh, that's what I'm gonna do for the rest of this video. Uh, more like, uh, uh showcase it. Um, uh, actually build the full thing, and there's a reason for that. Um, I'm not gonna explain the reason, because it doesn't really concern you guys at all, because you difference. But yeah, I'm gonna pause here, get some blocks to.
together for that, and I'll be right back in a sec. Hey guys, I'm back, and as you can see, I got the stuff, but as you can see here, what I meant was this path right here that goes to the end portal, and like the old farm there, really don't have any actual like way of it. Um, and I want to build an actual pathway and like something here uh, around the portal and stuff. I also have to fix this. Moglin, Poglin, Moglin. Oh no, Moglin the Poglin Trader. I don't know why I did that and had to go back and forth like that. Uh, yeah, that's basically what this rest of the series is going to be about in the next 5 10 minutes. Is gonna be. I'm not going to fully build it, I'm only going to build like the starting of it. Uh, for that. Uh, um. I'm not going to tell you why. So yeah, anyways, I'm going to start this off camera here, and I'll be back in a sec. Um, I'll probably also build around the portal. So I'll come back to you guys in a second. Alright guys, and I'm back. I worked on the portal area here a little bit. Uh, not too fancy, just a little basic thing. That, um, I'm going to put probably uh, lanterns, I think. Uh, Somewhere maybe in the middle of the uh, or still put there, I think. Um, I don't have them on me, and then uh, Dory looking things are they're gonna first place on this side just so you walk out. Um, I was hoping I can get this turned with it, but I uh, I guess it's not going to, so it's fine. Uh, and then it's and then I'm not gonna do it now, but it's still put and it's then make like a look just. Tiny, small little walkway to up the actual uh, flooring of this, I think, there. Uh, but for now, for the rest of the video, I'm actually able to at the, the starting area slash actual, uh, maybe like five or ten blocks out of this pathway here. Starting area. Um, it'll probably be a very similar design to my old, the other one I did on the last server. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do that off camera, and I'll come back to you guys when it's finished. Uh, when I'm done. All right, I'm back again here. <clears throat> all right, I'm back. Sorry about that. My voice went all like fro froggy, like for a second there, so I had to repause it. But this is bridge here. Uh, this is the idea of it, basically. This is what it looks gonna look like. Um, these are gonna be separated. Uh, I just wanted to do a con, like an of. of how far it's separated, so I did it this close. But yeah, this is basically what it's gonna look like. Um, I don't. What I may do is I may take these pillars and make them go up to the ceilings. So that way, it looks like it's connected. Uh, this one's gonna stay like that because it's connected to the ground. But like ones that are, that are like it, so often blocks away. Obviously, this is too close. So I'm gonna probably put them at these every 10 to 12 maybe like every 12 blocks away every eight blocks away uh like i said it's very similar to the last design being this bit over here as you can see it's the same you have one in there there and then you have the labs and then you have more stairs and then seats every so often um this is every eight blocks so again uh, one two three four five six oh this is seven that's probably why it looks close it, i feel like it would still look close even if it was one block away uh, for the actual light, I'm going to use shroom lights instead of glowstone, or I think I used glowstone the last one, or I used hanging lanterns, because uh, the shroom lights fit the theme better for uh, the nether. I'm probably going to put actually nether style uh, trapdoors on both sides, just to make it look all fancy. Um, I think before, before I think I used basalt uh, pillars, I'm going to use actual spruce logs just to kind of make it, make it look different uh also because i don't feel like collecting a shit sorry a crap ton of uh assault basically maybe i'll change these out for the there's nether wood briefs, but i kind of like the uh the spruce just because it looks under uh but we'll see because yeah because that take that block that look and put it over there like uh, imagine that that there like i can just
So if I replace these. It actually doesn't look too bad. I don't know, we'll see. Ow. But yeah, anyways, um that is gonna be it actually for this video. Uh again because I don't want to continue building and there's a reason for that and I just don't want to explain why. But I will probably I'll build this off camera and then do an update to it next video. Um anyways guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, don't forget. Like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.